Greetings everyone, it feels like it's been ages, but my name is Four Extraordinaire, and I wanted to get back to Civ 6 as it is the 30th anniversary, and it just feels like I've started with Civ 5, I eventually branched out onto Civ 6, um, and I mean I started as I just played a few games here and there, but I seriously got into Civ with Civ 6, and I started the YouTube channel because of that, so just coming around to 30 years is really, it just feels like it, it's been such a flyby um having started the channel back nearly a year ago in november on november 1st uh and all the way up until this point so first of all i just want to say uh congratulations to civ 6 for making it 30 years in the gaming industry especially the st strategy gaming industry which initially didn't really pop off um and making it all the way uh 30 years wow to september basically now i'm not here just to blush i did want to say that having seen the 30th anniversary trailer and the fact that they're also using this to, to promote the anthology pack makes me think that since there's not a flat out announcement, I don't think that there's going to be per se a announcement right this moment, like in the upcoming week. Though I will say that with the 30th anniversary kind of being on the coattails of humankind and everything with the overall hype for strategy games and like kind of coming off of, um, I think there was a recent games conference. Uh, I will say that I'm kind of expecting a Civ 7 announcement fairly soon, and a lot of people have been saying that, you know, Civ, uh, there's a really, with Civ, there's a usually a huge gap in terms of years, but you have to remember that the New Frontier Pass, Gathering Storm, and... Uh, Rise and Fall, I almost forgot the name of that pack, it was kind of insignificant. Anyhow, um, kind of with all of those expansion packs and then a year of the season pass, there really has been a lot of padding to kind of fill in like at least four years, especially with the base game. So I think it's entirely possible that kind of as we're coming down from this pandemic, that production time will increase with studios as they kind of... Um, taper off the whole coronavirus thing, and I think that Civ releases um, will at least become much more frequent with Civ 7, and hopefully with the DLC and expansion packs as we get more people back into the offices, hopefully, and again, production times increase. So that's kind of the end of this video. I wanted to make it short and to the point. As always, I wanted to make it succinct. And while I did ramble on just a tiny little bit, I do want to mention that uh, while you're here, I do have a Twitter if you manage to stick around for this video, uh, which you can follow. I like to post pretty little screenshots every now and then of the games I play, particularly I'm doing Humankind right now, and I have to say the visual aesthetics are amazing. So uh, <laughs> kiss to the chef there. Uh, anyhow, I also post my videos, so if you want to stay up the topic, uh, you can check out that. I also have a Discord that you can join. We're small at the moment, but I try to respond to uh, posts and questions within the day. So if you want to engage in little discussions, suggest some topics for the videos uh, that I plan to upload in the future, please let me know. Also, if you want to see the schedule, that's a great place to check out. Anyhow, this has been 4 Extraordinaire. I hope you guys like the video. Uh, leave a like and subscribe if you do. Anyhow, uh, I'll be heading out, and I uh, hope to see you guys later. All right. Love you guys. Peace.